Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Divinity Original Sin 2. Hey Bumpy, how's it going? It's going well, sir. How are you doing? I'm doing very well. We're starting the new game from Larian. Mm, very excited for this. It's been in, in uh, early access for a year now. Yep. Exactly a year. It's interesting. Just it over almost, here, isn't it? I think it was in the in the fifteenth of September that the oh, uh, yeah, of last right. year. You're right. So and just now, under course, a year because it's the fourteenth. Just under a year. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so we're playing the game together. We have. Uh, we have planned everything out, and uh, it's going to be the two of us going through this story and adventure and role-playing game and uh, see what's going to happen. It's so let's jump in. terribly, into... just so you know. <laughs> For me, mostly, because I'm, my character is interesting, but yeah. Anyway, see you in character creation. And here we are. And uh, this, these are our characters. Well, this is mine and Bumpy. Bumpy has his own. I'm Odasto. I'm an undead elf. A shadow blade. A guy that basically has a smart mouth and doesn't really like to uh, to be friends with others, even though he's actually a good guy. Uh, well, deep down below, he's a good guy. He's, he's a an old friend to... Uh, what's what's your character's name? I am the Red Prince. Apparently, I don't have a name. I'm literally the Red Prince. That's what the I The Red am. Prince. That sound, sounds good, yeah. Um, yeah, so he's, uh, he was in his guard, and he's now following him and trying to defend him and all that, but... They, they, they're friendly enough and have their own opinions about things and all that sort of stuff. And it was all uh, based off character? of his hat envy that I had. My amazing hat here. He was very <laughs> envious of it, and that's what it was. All right, well, I have an origin story since I have one of the specially uh, crafted characters that Larian Studios made for us. So let's go ahead and listen to that, and then we'll see my origin story. Famed, of course, for my unique red skin and unparalleled skills as a general of the House of War, I, the Red Prince, was raised within the vast palaces of the fabled Forbidden City. I was destined to become the next emperor. But my ambitions suffered a bit of a setback when I fell from grace for cavorting with demons. Now, I'm exiled and hunted by assassins. But I assure you, I remain undaunted and as determined as ever to claim my rightful throne. And now I have a subordinate named Colonel RPG. Well, I, what was your name again? <laughs> I already forgot his name. Odasto. Odasto. I, I think it's the default name for the undead elf. I think it looks, it sounds good. Well, there so, you go. I'm going to go with that. Well, he's yeah. my undead minion. He's going to help me reclaim the throne, or at least that's what I tell people. So, there you go. Or, or I'm going to try and take the throne from you. You just don't know. That's it awesome. all depends on whether or not I like your, your character. All right, so we did, <laughs> I, I did basically kept most of the origin the same. I did change uh, a few things, but we'll go over the different skills that I have. I have Dragon's Blaze, Breathe Flames in a Cone, dealing 4 to 5 damage, and Set People Burning for 2 turns resisted by magic armor. And then I have Demonic Stare. Mm -hmm. I drain 6 to 7 magic armor and I give it to myself. So it's pretty good stuff there. He's got Sophisticated yep. Spell Song. So those are, I guess, his two talents that he has. And we've decided that Battle Mage will probably augment the Colonel's wonderful, wonderful Shadow... What is it? Shadow Blade? Is that what you are? Shadow Blade, yes. Uh, so basically my character, because I'm, I'm going to be a thief effectively... Well, I'm more of an assassin kind of deal, uh, but I can I can um, I have thievery as my abilities, and I'm a scoundrel effectively. Uh, so I'll have throwing knife that works as a backstab, which is interesting. Uh, and I don't think you actually need the throwing knife, so I'm just gonna be able to throw knives at people out of nowhere. I nice. have uh, back backlash, which uh, is very amazing, and I'm I'm looking forward to using that. You'll see that on in combat pretty soon. And I also have uh, a way to put people to sleep. It's called chloro chloroform. Which is gonna, yeah. Basically, I'm gonna try and put people down to sleep, so you're and carry I'm basically a wet rag around and smother people with it. That's nice. Yeah, yeah. That's the way. That's the way to do it. Uh, then on the talent sort of thing, I'm gonna have gorilla, which is a pretty decent, a pretty uh, nondescript thing. It just does more damage when I'm sneaking, which I'm gonna try to be doing a lot of the time. My origins are mystic and outlaw because I'm kind of that sort of character. And my instrument is what's your instrument? I have the Aud. I have no idea how to say it. The A U, the O U D. Yeah, Aoud. mine is the t the tambura. I think we're gonna hear it every once in a while, but it's probably just a, a little, 
a little added thing. I'm a noble scholar, and I do have some skills here real quick. We'll run over. Uh, my talent is Pet Pal, so I can talk to animals. He can talk to undead because he's horrible, and that's oh, what yeah. he does. I uh, about to talk about that. I have the favorable wind. It basically controls the forces of nature, so the wind is literally at your party's back, and aura increases your allies' movement speeds while they stay close to me, which is nice. And I can battering ram through enemies, knocking them down and doing a bunch of damage to them. And I mm -hmm. have blinding radiance, which basically anyone within a small area around me is going to get blinded and take a little bit of air damage. So those are my skills that I'm bringing to the yeah. table. I actually didn't look at my uh, no, my uh, background skills. I can play dead. It's, and I have a domo protection, but I can play dead and just basically people don't attack me for three turns. But also I don't actually do anything for three turns, but That's it's interesting. That's not cool. I want to play dead. <laughs> Oh, well, you're going to need to save me when I play dead, because well, I'm not a very buff I, guy. I have 10% fire and poison resistance, which is cool. That's fine. I need poison to heal. We'll see. Anyway, let's start the game and uh, see the cinematic. All right. I'm waiting for you. Are you okay. ready? I am ready. Yes. We're all ready. Let's be ready. Let's. Together. Larian Studios presents A very pretty village It all happened like I knew it would A single drop of source magic And like flies to honey The monsters swarmed the rebel panicked. The carnage began. And the Magisters pointed their fingers at me. Just as I'd planned. I was shackled and collared. And sent to Fort Joy. That's you right there. Just chillin'. I'd come here to kill Godwoken. But instead, I became part of their story. She sounds like a nice lady. Divinity. Original Sin 2. Meaningless whispers. And there we go. Interesting setup. It's a total lie. She she didn't do any of that stuff on purpose. She just got arrogant, <laughs> and that's what happened. Okay, and we're in, in the boat, I suppose. Shackled. Maybe. Oh, boy. Things I are see happening. you. Aha! He's... There I'm we go. I have a headache, though. What a way to wake. Wooden boards and iron shackles. The Divine Order's hospitality leaves much to be desired indeed. Well, look what the dog. You're lucky they didn't notice just how thin you were under those bandages. Yeah, basically. Although, seeing someone wrapped up like that, they probably thought you had the scabbing plague. Hey, look, laugh, but don't touch. I, I don't want to. Better keep that hood down, mind you. The living don't take kindly to seeing their future staring back at them. I think that's directly meant at me. Yeah. Not at you. Yeah, Interesting. Creepy. Playing dead, are you? Probably a good idea. Creepy. Probably a good idea. Sound... Creepy skull, yeah. A That's all par cranium, that. Human. No I wonder. wonder. <laughs> right. Oh. I'm not a human either. Oh, what's going on over here? Alright, so where are we going? The colonel's nope. gonna lead me on this fantastic cold journey. Can we how do we rotate the oh, camera? You're up. Do we? Yes. Yeah, you can so middle click. Nice bit of work, even if I do say so myself. Shall we uh, talk to her? Not yep. too tight, I Apparently hope. I did. The Sorry. color, I mean. Oh, not to worry. Every dog has to get used to its leash. I'll need to write to headquarters right away. In All the right. meantime, your next stop will be Magister William. All passengers have to be registered in the ship's manifest, and he's the chap in charge of the logs. Is You'll he? find him on the other side of this deck, in the officers' quarters. Uh, you pull at the thing around your neck futilely. Demand to know why she's collared you. Tell me, why, woman! for my peace of mind, of course. 
Why don't you try casting one of those source spells of yours? See what happens. Ooh. Ooh, uh, you recall the power building inside you. Stare at the enthralled demon. Unleash. Ooh, this is going to be bad, isn't it? Oh god. Uh, yeah, go Cards ahead. Go ahead. Magic surge inside you, boiling, bursting, then breaking, only to fade back into your Aww. soul like rain into the earth. It's like with a whimper. Mm. My, look at the concentration on your face. All will, but no result. She's pretty cocky. There you have it. See, the collar's function. It neuters you. Of sorts. Mm. Makes you unable to cast source. For your own peace of mind, of course. Uh -huh. Yours and the whole world. Oh, I have all sorts of little options here. You... Okay. It's because of your uh, backgrounds. And interesting stuff, I can see what you're trying to select. It's interesting. Oh, really? Like when I switch? Yeah, switches. yeah. It's pretty oh, cool. It's pretty neat. Muse that by the room's shape. You can tell you're on Lucian class frigate, but why? Why? Because we're at sea, of course, and have been for several days. Index fingers pressed to her lips. She pauses a moment to give you a scrutinizing gander. My word, you do seem a bit befuddled, don't you? Yep. Perhaps I was a bit too <laughs> generous with that sedative. Yes, you were. Oh, well, I'm sure you'll soon gather your wits. Most likely. Eventually. <laughs> In the meantime, all you need to know is that we're en route to Fort Joy. A new life awaits. And if you're a particularly good boy, perhaps Ooh. a cure as well. An end to source. For what? Good. I am a particularly good boy. Wait, are we joining the source hunters? L. L does something. Oh, what is this? That's our journal? No, that was tab. That was, no, that was me pressing tab. She immediately drawn her, drew her weapons. Oh. <laughs> uh, don't worry. It's fine. There is, though, if you press alt, you can see all the... Um... Oh, yeah. Ancient book. Which is bad. I'm gonna uh, yeah, don't take that. I'm gonna take this thing. Can you okay. can you go into sneak mode if I distract her and steal the book? Uh, yeah, I I might. Oh, I'm going around the other way. And you've been told why. Okay. There really is no need for you to leave. Let me try. Your sneaking failed. Don't worry. It's when I left. Sneaking. Uh, we probably should save. Uh, can okay. you save? How do I? Is it F5? Yes, it is. Yeah. All right. It's you. Oh, okay. oh. oh. <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll, I'll engage her in conversation to get, get, Ooh, oh, I saw oh, it. I stole it. it. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Let me see what it is. <laughs> she turned around. It's like the surprise. source. The source. I'm gonna read it out to you. The source king insists there are no magics to too foul, even those that would block or even remove the source within an individual. I delight in his madness. Oh boy, it is an invitation to manipulate all which we once believed immutable. He provides all manner of experimental subjects, and the text beneath, beneath lists a series of X's and material required for muting source. Hmm. That's what she meant by the cure. The cure for the source. Does this... Also, does, you... Oh, you can, you can steal from her. You, can you steal from her? Uh, I might be able to. I don't want to do that. It says theory uh, required one. Oh, you don't have to. Yeah, you I don't can, want to. I can't. I can. Go ahead and save the game. Oh, save it again. All right. Okay. Oh, I can see her stuff. Oh, yeah, she doesn't have anything for me. Uh, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll not take anything from her at this moment. Okay. Let's, let's see what else is on this ship. That was pretty. Go ahead Does it time. still crack you up when you see? Oh, oh hold on. There's, there's been a murder here. Did you there talk has. to somebody or? Quite the mess, no. mate. Behind the oh, magister, oh, a did. bloodied okay. mass lies in a heap. Gore and limbs lie at odd angles. Okay. You can't make out a face amid the mess. I'm gonna turn my head away. No, I'm not. I'm gonna peer into the room and ask what happened. There's been a murder. A sorcerer was killed by one of your own. Lucky you were busy getting your collar fitted at the time, or you'd be a suspect like the rest of them. Waters is investigating. She'll figure out who did it. Always does. Okay, I, um, I, I am, I'm intrigued by the way these, uh, dialogues are written. Have you noticed that it's like, ask if he knew the dead man. We can actually roleplay the, the the dialogue there. And that's pretty cool, don't you think? Maybe. We I'm going to try and do that. Lend the hand, ask if he knew. Yeah. Uh, did you lend a hand in the investigation? I'm going to go with that. I think this sounds more interesting. Aren't you enterprising? I'll let Waters tell you now herself. <laughs> go ahead. She with the body. That's great. Mm -hmm. Well, let me, let me go on in. Ooh. 
Oh. Was he already here? Oh, I don't close the door. door. I didn't mean to. I'm bad at clicking things, apparently. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to her then. Okay. Ugly sight, isn't it? We hope this happened under our protection. We're extremely lucky no void walk and followed the source that did this. Yeah, you weren't his this man's protector. You were his captor. Finn didn't see it like that. He was desperate for us to help him. Two things scared the living daylights out of him. His own shadow and his own source. Uh, hmm. We'll find out who did this. Speaking of... She looks up at you with a mirthless smile. I was on duty in your room when the murder happened. You were asleep the whole time. Didn't even stir. You're one of the only indisputably innocent people on the ship. Unless you can commit murder in your sleep, of course. <laughs> yeah, that's a Maybe. trick I haven't quite mastered. <laughs> I thought as much. Listen, I'm a battle mage. I could use someone to keep their yeah. ears open among the passengers. Sometimes they clam up in front of a uniform. Bring me a good lead, and I'll throw in a shiny gold coin for you. How about that? So are you a snitch? Uh, yeah, I am. I'm definitely am. But uh, <laughs> my price is definitely higher than that. Not in here, it isn't. Oh, he just got me shut down. You hear anything? <laughs> Whoever did this is dangerous. Okay. Well, uh, Prince, you go on ahead and uh, lead the investigation. What's going on in here? There's a broken source collar amulet thingy. Ooh. Maybe I can this... distract her if I get around behind. I, I well, I can try. Let me see. So, so I might be able to. Yeah. interesting for me. Can you save the game, just in case? Uh, yes, I can. Ask her Ooh. to define interesting. I'll take that. There's a chunk of flesh in there. Oh, I can eat it. Okay, let me eat <laughs> the chunk eat. of. Oh, she's yeah. moving around. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna eat the. You, you, the you didn't get the. Join me, join me. Oh, you feel his consciousness nice. enter yours. You, did, you should have saved that. Yours to experience. Oh, oh, she's talking. You oh, sorry. Finn. <laughs> As a oh, yeah, you need you, you can't you can't talk over the lines, otherwise you're gonna hear the line. <laughs> you're already talking. Uh, but yeah, can you listen in on the conversation? Yeah. Yeah. So basically, his memories are are mine, and I am Finn. Oh. Your heart is heavy. You know too much. It's all too much. You met, you met him. A bright light blinds you, then fades. You feel a tremendous power in your hands, but they are shaking so hard you can barely use them. Suddenly you're on this very ship, crouched in a corner, hugging your knees. A figure approaches, an older woman. Her eyes are kind. She comes closer. She says she wants to talk. She reaches a hand toward you. You grasp it. The memories end. You are no longer Finn. You return to yourself with a jolt. What a ripoff. Older woman, we have a lead. And I have also a new skill called adrenaline for some reason. <laughs> Did you were you able to steal the collar or no? Uh no, not the collar. I accessed the body instead. Uh but I think I will be able to Can you save? Yeah, give please. Me a sec. Oh. It seems as though there's a pattern in the blood flow. That oh, can't a pattern? Be oh, she saw me. Oh boy, you there. You've got the look of a thief. I need to look through your bags, all of them. Uh I sure. Go right ahead. Right then. Let's see what you have what I find. Ha! Proof. Oh, gosh. Pay for a crime thief. Oh boy. Oh no. She draws a weapon and skulls. What have you and... done? Oh well, just reload. We're not gonna wanna pick a fight with these guys. I think we wanna pick a fight with them. Do you think so? I don't know. Let's see how it works. She's crazy tough. She's only got forty five Go she only got forty five okay. HP. Let's go ahead and do this. Uh, okay, so I need... Oh, Sleeping blocked by magic blocked armor. By magic armor. We're gonna, we have to learn how this stuff all works. Yeah, so she has magic armor. That's which the is thing the, uh... on our top right, right? Yeah. She's going to kill us, though. Oh, she shot you in the face. Point blank. Ooh, yeah. She doesn't even There's care. There's no way. There's no way. This is not supposed to happen, basically. We got a poetry book on at the back. That might be a, a clue. It's your turn now. I know. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do to prevent us from all dying a horrible death. I'm also gonna stop at something that I hate, which is the auto center. Let's see here, blinding radiance. How far out does? Oh gosh. Ooh, that sounds good. Am I gonna hit you good. too? No, don't worry. You're not gonna hit me. 
I'll yield to none. You sure I didn't just hit you? Nope. But Okay, end of my turn. Oh, they have friends! Oh. Yeah, of course, this is death. We can't, we need to reload. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, she. I don't know how she saw me, but she might have seen the item fly away, which is a really good improvement over the first game, because I don't think they did that in the first game. All right, so we're gonna on. need to wait until she looks elsewhere, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna steal that. So. All right, she's looking at me. Can you get around from the other moment? side? I'll keep her. Trying to. See. Tell her you're still looking around. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. Do you want to pick up that poetry book? Uh, sure. Broken source. All right, I'm outside. I'm gonna look at the poetry book. We used to he, read. Does he bear any clue? A woman from Driftwood with nary a care offered me kisses that answered my prayer. I accepted her gift, and then to my dismay, a spider she was, and I ate her, and I her buffet. Once feasting was <laughs> over, she licked her red lips. I rose from the floor, still coming to grip. She thanked me for coming, and boo, you did something and ruined it. What happened? Halt, I due didn't... to recent thefts. We'll search. Oh, uh, she noticed. Oh, yeah, you can you can let I'll her. I'll try to talk her out of it. No, 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 you can let her because you don't have anything stolen on your During inventory. During persuasion events, you can try to persuade the person you're talking to. Let's try. Okay, go for it. Um, let's see here. Uh, say that you're transporting the pack for a friend and promise you keep the contents private. Hold your hand to your stomach so that you're going to be sick. Let the lizard shake your head. Would this be happening if you weren't a lizard? <laughs> yes. Oh, you failed. So you're a thief and a liar. Oh, oh no. Yeah. Ah. So, yeah, it, it, she notices. She oh, notices. Gosh. All right, so we can't. Don't worry. We can't steal everything. We can't steal that. Yeah, yeah. It's good. It's good. Or if we good do, we should. That. What if we What if we close the door? It seems as though come out too? Nah, it's nah don't bother. It's, there's nothing on the collar. We, uh, stealing that doesn't, man, doesn't matter. I can f figure out anything. You can steal that, though. Yeah. So we're looking for. Oh, who's this lady? Magistral Merrill. That's the lady. Let no, me, that's a new lady. Let me finish my. Uh, let me finish oh, the my, book. My yeah. Poetry. I rose from the floor, still coming to grip. She thanked me for coming and bade her farewell. My prayer indeed answered, though still I did swell. I, hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it's not a very good poetry book. No, it Maybe started that's why okay. She him. It did. It did. I liked it. Do you want to talk to this uh, magistral Meryl over here? Oh, the chick on the right? Yeah, she was there. You yeah. just ignored There's... her. All right, I'll talk to her. A young magister stands pale and silent. Her knuckles whiten mm. around her weapon as you pass. That's it. Nothing else. Yeah. I don't know what to say. We're looking for an older woman, though. Hey, anyone in here? Ooh. There's kids. Maybe oh. they know something. There's a sheep. Wait, I talked to animals. Hold on. Oh, yeah, good, good, good. <laughs> I'm not suited for this. <laughs> It's sea cow, not sea sheep. <laughs> it's sea cow, not sea sheep. Sorry. Admire the sheep's wool and ask if you might take a bit. Yes, I guess. Let's go for that. Yeah. Haven't got any shoes, have you? People, People these, these days. days. <laughs> so good. <laughs> I'm oh boy. sorry. Well, if we find a shears, we can come back and get it. There's, There's a, a lot of people roll, around here. A bucket. There's. Is that a bedroll, or is that just like a giant rope? I think, you know, it's, it's, that you're looking at the, oh, did you take it? I sure. did, it was a rope, and it wasn't highlighted with all. No, that's, the bedroll is somewhere else. Um, <gasps> there's a helmet. There's... Oh, nice, get it. Okay, I'm getting a little bit of food over here. Can you see the items that getting into my inventory? You can't, right? Or, anyway, it doesn't matter. <laughs> How do I look? Oh, not good. <laughs> oh, the bucket in the head. That thing removes perception. Be careful. It removes initiative, actually. Oh, initiative. Yeah, it changed. They changed it then. Do you want to talk to these kids? It's funny. Now you go ahead and talk to them. Okay. okay. Join me in. I'm here because I'm magic. Are you here because you're weird? <laughs> right. I think so. Do you know Losa? She's a really good singer. I'm better though. Listen. La 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 la. Oh. No. No. Okay, the kids don't say anything. Do you want to talk to that one? Sure. Is that right? Wow! Are you a dragon? You look like a dragon. You are Jill, aren't you? Why are you weak? I am a dragon. I'm just a, a walking dragon. That's what I do. You are a dragon. Yeah, that's a good point. Hey, look, there's a bucket there for you. I don't want buckets. Maybe I... Nah, no, I need, I need initiative. But there's a grown lossy over here. Source muted. That's what they are. 
What's that? Yeah, that's that. Yeah, you know, let me talk over here to Lossie. Ah, there you are. Um, oh. Husband. Husband? Would you please oh. tell this very charming gaggle of not at all brat like babes <laughs> that I am by no accounts this loser woman, nor do I sing, in fact. I'm deathly, deathly allergical. Uh, allergical? Uh, who's Lossie? The young woman seems about to raise her hand, but quickly remembers herself and nods pointedly at the excited children. Who indeed? Why, my name is, um, Madame Josephine Gribbles de Peeb. It's impressive. Yeah. The children break out into giggles. <laughs> I say, it is. Her pinched face cracks into a great grin, and she shoos the children away from her with a laugh. Yeah, okay, you found me out. Go on and git, and maybe I'll sing you something when I'm good and ready. She turns to you, dark-eyed and dirty-haired, and smiles flatly. Gotta keep ourselves entertained, haven't we? Uh, well, uh, couldn't you find some more age-appropriate companions, I suppose? Like oh, yourself, geez. maybe. Oh, boy. <laughs> I don't mind the kiddies, usually. Well, yeah, well, do you know anything about the murder that happened on board? Because that's kind of the reason why we're here. Nope. Trying not to find anything out either. Ignorance is bliss. The utterer, the better. Join us. Yes, you have to have a look around with us. You can watch each other. We can watch each other's backs. Thanks, but I already belong to an elite and exclusive ship gang. We play ball every day after lunch. You're oh, come too on. soft for it. Oh, I, I'm definitely not. I'm undead, lady, but you, you don't know that. You take care, though. See you later. Suddenly, her oh. eyes cloud to an unnatural black. Uh, Greyish veins run down her face, and her what? mouth tightens into a cruel sneer. As quickly as they came, the clouds clear. She smiles as though no change came over her. That's the source. Good luck, Chief. Yeah. Uh huh. Look, that's the source, right? Anyway. It wouldn't make sense that it'd be the case. I do not know. But what I do know is we are about out of time, sir. Yep. Yeah. We have a dog over here that you need to talk to, but that's going to be for the next. You. Nope. Sorcerer. Blood. No. Go. Yeah. <laughs> that's great. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's talk to his master on the next episode. For right now, we are Kernel RPG and Bumpy McSqueakums. We And this has been Divinity Original Sin 2. We really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment. Like the video. But above all, thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you next episode. Bye-bye. Bucket head says bye.